Richard! <laughs> oh, wow! Keep my wife's name out your f mouth! Oh, I can, oh, okay. It felt, it just felt like me because also there's something about it that feels very old Hollywood. My better half bought me this purse from Sophia Webster and I love it so much. I'm very happy to be wearing something that a lot of people put work into. I just want to be able to show it off for them. This necklace, do we know how many carats it is? I don't know, but I know that like um, there's security guards. <laughs> Lily James wasn't the only star in pale pink, but the night's biggest trend? Red, red, and more red. This is Christian Siriano. He made it for me. What? He drew it out 
and I went, that's the one. Oh my God, it's a little pearls and diamonds, whatever, and a little Carolina Herrera. Oh my God, it makes me feel like there's bubbles inside me. Jennifer Garner was glam in an off-the-shoulder gown, while Best Supporting Actress winner Ariana DeBose rocked a crimson crop top, a cape, and pants. The star's motto, go bright or go home. Sorry, I had to show everyone my outfit. Yeah, Hers kiwi-colored Carolina Herrera dress matched the custom David Coma look Beyonce performed in. It feels good! During the ceremony, B was in a bold yellow Valentino ensemble with a $4,000 purse, while nominee Ingenue Ellis's custom Versace ball gown took 1,300 hours to complete and honored her late mother. It says, right there. Jack's baby. My mother's name was Jacqueline, and so I'm Jack's baby. And then there was Kristen Stewart breaking all the fashion rules in custom Chanel shorts. After posing for pics, K Stu ditched her heels and later changed into a dress, still Chanel, for the Vanity Fair after party. But she wasn't the only star rocking two looks in one night. Zendaya went from a cropped white collared shirt to a full tux. And shout out to her Dune co star, Timothy Chalamet, who went shirtless under his sparkly Louis Vuitton pantsuit from the women's line. Other star transformations, Kourtney Kardashian, Zoe Kravitz, Jessica Chastain, and Tiffany Haddish, who went from this. I'm wearing custom Dolce Gabbana. I am in Italian from head to toe, and help, hopefully later on I'll get some Italian in me. And I mean spaghetti. I mean spaghetti. To this. This what fame look like. This what success look like. This what money look like. If that's what money looks like, then we're not quite sure how to categorize this look. Kanye's ex Julia Fox dress featured a claw grabbing her neck and a handbag made out of real human hair. But she wasn't the only star that got our attention. What's the secret about the outfit? And they cut the hips out, and I don't really have hips. So the secret is that, you know, you just gotta be Megan Thee Stallion or <laughs> pull it off. <laughs>